Morega, Omode, Tokwa Yoro Warwagirwa GMO, Ruriadu Ara Kere Idio Furudine Wa Djibuti, Age Koroe Murumiri Wa Chanueno, Neoerwa Yorwagi Kuyo, Nikuga Umete Kenya. Na Djibuti, emwe na waru wogo hakuhina fururi wa Kenya, kwa uohara wayo nwa ukuhu utetie. Ok, toku gate, viko nini yeheto kete, ruwagiru ike muno, niru are kere ilio kuhu fururi ni usio wa Djibuti. Na mudheba waru wagiru urura are kere ilio, lueta guo Anopheles Stevensi. Mudheba waru wagiru urura wa Jaba, Rudhode ketu na kabu ni itaguo Oxitec kuma fururi wa Geretha na okuwa ga mawazo mavero maria mora ga garuwa giruwa muera utana gimara. Yetumi ya kura garuwa giruwa muera ni todo muera niguo otoromaga noga tabia tumigini toreato taba ya mirimota malaria. Na getumi kia ruwa geruwa mwera koro mamodo, ninegeza inywe za kame ina proteini, ilia ikuza gira guza odeka matube maria matuwe kaga ruwa geruoge. No huone kuga, dhuda wako nyihia ruwa geruri ya rukuwete mingini shubeshi ya merimo, na yo merimo noe, noe konyiha. Hihi noe yorie, dhuda wako eko huore, shube ikene shiko haraga nyo kana idho keri o motorele wa asio. Kwe na giri dhato na magana matano medheba ya arwa kethe ini wadhe. Na noga shuje kanini ka medhebe no yodhe za kuwa ga mingini shube ya amirimo. Odo ama geka niyane ate, odhuduri o shio okonie o mudhebo mwe warwa giruru kuwa ga murimo. O giriri kana vijo ekonie murimo wa malaria, niyo e mudhebo mwe wa mingini rere haga murimo. Owe shiri ate ohoro wakego ni kuma na odhuduri o shio, ketu kona na hede yoege. Hi, so in today's video we'll be talking about the recent release of genetically modified mosquitoes in Djibouti. This is the English version because it seems like the audience seems to like to hear English versus read the subtitles. So that's what we're doing now. If you're on this channel and you can understand Gekoyo or you're interested in Gekoyo, you're likely from Kenya, which is also located in East Africa. And therefore this topic is of general interest and relevance to you. So a few days ago, tens of thousands of genetically modified mosquitoes were recently released into Djibouti. And the specific type of mosquito has been characterized by researchers and is called Anopheles stevensi. And according to the reference article, this particular mosquito is a male mosquito that was developed by Oxitec, which is a UK-based biotechnology company. And the unique thing about this mosquito is that once it mates with another mosquito, basically, it passes along a gene that kills female offspring before they reach maturity. And the reason why female mosquitoes are being targeted is it's because it's only female mosquitoes that bite and in this way end up transmitting pathogens that can cause diseases like malaria. And the reason why they suck blood is because they typically will need some extra protein for their eggs. And the big idea is that if the number of disease-carrying mosquitoes are reduced, then the prevalence of the germs that infect us in the population will be reduced and in this way reduce the incidence of these particular diseases. Now you may be concerned about the consequences to ecosystems and existing food chains because all animals and insects work together in an ecosystem, right? The current answer seems to be that there are over 3,500 species of mosquito on Earth. Yet from this great diversity, only a small handful can carry the pathogens that cause disease. And so what's interesting about this technology that we just discussed is that it is species specific, meaning that only the Anopheles defensive ones will die. Now if you watched my malaria video, you are already aware of one of the parasites that is carried by mosquitoes. So what do you think of this particular solution? Thanks so much for listening and I'll see you in the next video.